from the threes. Welcome back everyone. One last look at that weather forecast for you today. A foggy start out there this morning. And we'll see that fog kind of stick around up through the majority of the morning. This is a look at the intersection of Vero School Road and Pinhook. You're looking down Pinhook. You can see visibility not the best. It is warm outside though. 65 your current temperature here in Lafayette. 62 out over towards Karen Crow. Low 60s between Opelousas and Alexandria. Similar story down along the coastline as well. Now we're going to be very, very warm today. We're going to be fairly muggy today as well. We'll see temperatures get into the mid 70s, about 75 degrees. A lot of clouds out there. The fog is going to stick around through the first half of the day. Be on the look out for some very light passing showers 20 30 percent on your rain chances now i do think as we get into the afternoon we'll start to see some patchy clearing patchy sunshine really at best it's not going to be bright blue skies all day long but we shouldn't keep uh, gray skies going all the way through into the afternoon now overnight tonight that fog is going to return we're going to see this forecast kind of repeat itself over and over again over the next several days so it feels very spring like outside 75 for your high again patchy sunshine at times still mostly cloudy skies that i don't think it's going to be wall to wall cloud cover there will be breaks 64 for your overnight low tonight and as we move ahead through the next five days you'll see temperatures get close to about 80 degrees even by Wednesday and Thursday. A lot of clouds out there for Thursday as the next front makes its way through the area. And as we get into the weekend, we will freshen up a little bit with the uh, post front weather, but back being to warm again by next week. So we do stay warm here over the next couple weeks. Thanks, Daniel. A chemical spill has forced some who live on Mud Avenue, North Buchanan Street and Bragg Street out of their homes. LUS representatives say a small amount of hydrated lime was released from their north water plant, causing a cloud to spread over the area. And if you're taking LA 3211 in Franklin this morning, you may want to change your route. Chittimacha police are uh, reporting that the highway is closed with its intersection with the BNSF Railroad. Crews are expected to finish making repairs to the intersection this afternoon by around 2. And you can detour around that area via Highway 90, LA 83, and LA 182. And here's one last look at that 24-hour forecast. High getting up to around 75 degrees today. Your low tonight down to around 64. Mostly cloudy skies out there with a lot of fog hanging around through the day. Be on the lookout for a quick passing shower.